Hi, it's Laura and welcome to Laura's Craft and in this video we are going to be making uh, a gorgeous uh, rustic Christmas wreath. Uh, it's going to have the classic red and green colors and much more. So if you are interested in how to create a gorgeous wreath for your front door, stay with me and let's get started. I'm going to use one of those birch wreath base, uh, which diameter is uh, 33 cm. I'm also going to use a variety of pigs um, and I'm only covering a portion of the wreath. However, if you wish to co cover the entire wreath, please do so. And I started with one side uh, and all I did was insert them throughout. Uh, if you wish, you can add um, a hot glue at the end um, and I'm doing doing a few stamps uh, on each side and uh, I keep uh, building up more foliage in these areas uh, that might need a little bit more. So next I'm adding pine cones and some greenery. And I believe they are olive tree leaves um, and I'm gluing them with a hot glue just to keep them in place. I already made my bow of camera and I'm attaching with a zip tie. And then I took a large stem of red berries and I removed each individual pieces and adding them to the wreath.
I collected those branches from my garden, dried them well and spray painted in white and then I spreading them throughout the wreath. So next I'm making coil from the wire and spray painting with a gold glitter. Sorry guys for that, but a few minutes later I've noticed that my camera died. So as you can see I spread those metal coils uh, throughout uh, the wreath. For the last touch I'm going to make a Merry Christmas sign. I'm painting this plywood piece in white chalk paint. Once the painting was dried, I used some sandpaper to distress the white paint. I drill a small holes on the both sides to run some twine through and I'm using a Merry Christmas stencil.
So now I'm attaching to the breeze. finish my wreath I'm adding a um, small velvet ribbon bow and that was it my work is completed if you like this video don't forget to comment share with your friend and if you are new here don't forget to hit that subscribe button so guys uh, thank you for watching and see you next time bye